You know what just chaps my rear end? I mean, it just infuriates me more than anything else. <laughs> I don't know if my rear end actually gets chapped by it or not, but it's when I buy a technology and it doesn't work. Specifically, Bluetooth technology. It irritates me to no end when I buy a new Bluetooth product and I can't get it to pair to my Bluetooth device like my phone. That just, oh, you know what I'm saying? It just, just, just sometimes you just have to, oh, you buy it to better your life. And yet somehow it temporarily destroys your life. Why? Hopefully, my struggles and what I've had to fight, hopefully it'll help you out somehow, some way it'll help you better your life rather than, so you don't have to deal with the frustrations I've had to deal with. But first things first, it's a beautiful day, so I'm gonna swap out the lens and I'm gonna go outside. What's going on everybody? My name is Rodney and on my channel, I like to do little tech reviews and tips and tricks videos just like this one. So if you guys are having issues that I've run into or other people I know have run into, hopefully it'll help you out. So if you're new to this channel, please consider subscribing. And as always, give this video a like rating and share it with your friends. What I was dealing with, my Bluetooth uh, speaker, no, headphones, not speakers, my Bluetooth headphones, they were they connect to each other and they're supposed to connect to the phone. Well, what was happening, I could get one of them to connect to the phone or I could get the other one to connect to the phone. But what would happen is when I cut them both on, they would pair to each other and then they would not link up with the phone. So I found a couple of tips and tricks. I did a lot of reading on it and nothing actually helped when it came to reading. I actually figured this one out myself and so I wanted to pass along the steps that I took and maybe you... Um, Maybe it'll help you out and you can follow these steps and hopefully if you're having the same issue, uh, this will help you out. God, how many times am I going to say help you out in that one, uh, that one scene? Uh, I don't know. Let's see. Help you out, help you out, help you out, help you out, help you out. Okay, that's enough. The first thing I did, uh, I unpaired the, my Bluetooth uh, headphones from my phone. That was step number one. <clears throat> and by doing that, I actually had to go into my Bluetooth settings and told my phone to forget this device so that uh, the phone would not even recognize it as a paired Bluetooth device. <laughs> and then what I did, um, I actually had to go in, and, and step number two, I had to go in and reset my Bluetooth headphones. Uh, and depending on what kind of Bluetooth headphones you've got, there may be actually a different way to uh, to, re to go back to a factory reset. And so that's what I had to do. I had to figure out how to go to the factory reset on my, my headphones themselves. And once I did that, then I was able to go back and try to repair my headphones uh, to my cell phone. Before you try to pair your device to your cell phone, uh, read the instructions on how it is you're actually supposed to pair it because I didn't read the instructions I just figured hey I've done this a hundred times everything's the same but come to find out it's actually quite different uh, <laughs> at least this one was and this oh my gosh y'all I can't even begin to tell you how big of a headache this was for me I was getting so mad I spent I probably spent a good 30 to 45 minutes trying to figure out how to get this thing paired up. I even went as far as to, I emailed the company that made the headphones and I, I, I asked them, I was like, look, what's going on? They're pairing each other, they're not pairing to my phone. What's happening? And they emailed me back and they were no help at all uh, whatsoever when it came to, to fixing this problem. So I was like, man, forget y'all, I'm gonna figure this out on my own. Believe it or not, there was a time I could do that. I was a little bit younger too. <laughs> I don't know how bad that looked. If it looks as bad as it felt, I hope you enjoy that. <clears throat> now I had to do the factory reset on my Bluetooth, but maybe you won't have to do that. Just tell your phone or your device to forget the, the speaker or the, or the headset or whatever it is you're using. Tell your device to forget that speaker 
and then try to repair it and see if that that just not repair like fix but actually repair it to your phone uh, see if that fixes it for you I tried that a few times and it wouldn't work eventually I had to do the factory reset but maybe you won't have to go that far maybe if you just tell your device to forget it and then you can just try to re uh, repair it to the phone and hopefully that'll fix your issue but if that doesn't again you're gonna have to go with that that factory reset and I know it's a pain in the rear end but it's something you need to do and it's something hopefully it'll fix the problem if that doesn't fix the problem then something's off one of the devices maybe is super old or just not gonna talk with a newer device or something like that so I would encourage you to reach out to the manufacturer of the device. I'm gonna go in and ice my shoulder because I think I've dislocated something. <laughs> I'm just, I'm such an athlete. I mean, you know, there was, a, there was a time. There was a time. All right, guys, my name is Rodney. If you hadn't already subscribed to this channel, please consider doing so. Uh, I'll talk to you next time.